I'm Darren Marlar, and this is a Weird Darkness Bonus Bite. From ParanormalityMag.com Alleged Alien Photographed Walking Along Bolivia's Pilcomeo River by Brandon Grimes A photograph capturing a captivating and seemingly semi-transparent extraterrestrial presence has taken the Internet by storm. The image, which gained viral traction on social media, depicts a peculiar occurrence along the serene Pilcomayo River in Tarija, Bolivia. In the foreground, a man is being filmed, unaware of the unexpected anomaly unfolding behind him. The enigmatic entity, showcased in the photograph, boasts extraordinary features – elongated limbs, an almost skull-like head, and an uncanny resemblance to the archetypal alien often portrayed in science fiction movies and TV series. What sets this figure apart is its semi-transparent nature, allowing a glimpse of the background through its ethereal form. Ufologist Javier Carlos Cordero remarked on the striking resemblance to the classic depiction of a gray being often associated with extraterrestrial lore, though he emphasized the necessity of subjecting the image to thorough scrutiny. The city of Teresia seems to have a magnetic allure for such unusual incidents deepening the speculation that there might be underlying factors at play. Cordero's statement underscores the notion that this occurrence might shed light on broader mysteries. However, skeptics are not swayed, contending that the photograph is a cleverly constructed ruse with the alien entity digitally superimposed into the image. Their skepticism is fueled in part by the absence of any reflection in the nearby water, a detail that seems to challenge the authenticity of the sighting. As discussions continue to unfold online and in the realm of ufology, the photograph raises more questions than answers, leaving both believers and skeptics to engage in a lively debate over its legitimacy. I'll let you decide whether it's real or not. You can see the photo and a link to the original article in the show notes. And find more news in the Weird News and blog at WeirdDarkness.com.